I love how YouTube does copyright. <laughs> they, they copyrighted my last video um, because I sang the song, a part of the song. It wasn't even playing on the radio. It's so stupid. But anyway, um, doesn't matter. Anyway, I'm still going to make videos. <laughs> um, as long as I can, but or as long as I'm led. Let me go turn this lower, though. Let me hold one. Okay. So, um, I am making a lasagna, and I'm trying to do at least one freezer meal for this week coming up. Um, I like to do that sometimes. Cause I don't, who wants to cook all the time, you know? Unless you love to do that kind of stuff. Unless you are a chef. But anyway, um, I, wanted, I was listening to this song and it was saying it's always been you it's always been you it's always been you and I thought to myself yeah it's always been you father <laughs> I can look back on my life and even when I wasn't saved I could see certain things that the Lord would, uh, worked in my life and saved me from can you imagine all the things that he saved you from that you couldn't even understand or comprehend or didn't even realize. Um, there was one time uh, I knew I was a goner. I was working, I was living in Georgia, and I was working, and I was on my way home to pick up my son, and I picked my son up, and it was almost midnight, and we were headed back home and I'm not from Georgia I'm from Louisiana so I basically right when I got my license here in Louisiana I moved to Georgia got married moved to Georgia and literally Georgia was like my driving experience <laughs> so it really taught me self uh, defensive defensive driving and all that all that good stuff so I have to say I'm a really great driver, but um, we were on our way back to the military base, and it was we were almost there too. And I'll never forget this. And it was um, he was I want to say he was about four months old, and um, we were driving. I was driving, and. I we I was in a it's a fast kind of car. It was a fast kind of car. It was a Hyundai Tiburon. So I don't even know if they make those anymore. But I was driving a little bit fast and it was a little dark where I was on the highway and there was hardly anyone on the road and I was supposed to turn literally guys all I saw was the wall. I knew I was about to like go. I was like, this is the end of us. And I just let go. And I felt my car pick itself up within a matter of seconds. Literally turn itself. I grabbed back to the wheel and I was like, how am I still on the road? And it was like, it was turning the wheel as I was put my hands back on the wheel. And I just follow, followed along with it. <clears throat> but I'll never forget that. That was amazing. That was an, one amazing part of my life that I, I knew it was supernatural. And I knew, <clears throat> you know, God's angels and Him protected us at that time. Um, let me turn this. Um, so... How many times has he has God protected you in your life, even when you were an unbeliever? How many times? Okay, let me just say this. I know the Bible. You know He says He's angry all all of His days on the with the unbeliever. But let me tell you this. God, what He's angry about is sin. He's angry about the fall. He's angry that that it happened and it went that and it went that way not that he was surprised um god is all knowing right but he that he's not angry 
You know, he doesn't hate people. And so, uh, when people say, you know, he hates the unbeliever, he this and that with the unbeliever, he doesn't interfere, he doesn't interfere into the unbeliever's lives. Yes, he does. <laughs> because I can look back on my life, even when I wasn't saved, and I can see, literally see, certain things that happened in my life that I knew was from the Lord. I knew, I knew, I knew without a shadow of a doubt that it was from the Lord. So the song, and I don't remember the name of it, but it was like, it's always been you, Lord. It's always been you, Lord. We can literally, literally look back and we can literally see and we can say, Father, it has always been you. God loves us. For God so loved the world. That he gave his only begotten son, that whosoever shall believe it, on the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, shall be saved. Because the Father loves you that much. Even when you're not a believer. He knows. He is all knowing, all seeing, all doing. He is above and beyond. He is the beginning to the end. He knows everything he's everywhere is at all times <laughs> but um be of good cheer be of good comfort the lord knows what you're going through now uh and he wants you to feel that sound peace that you have in your life that sound rest you know he wants you to experience the sound rest the sound peace you know, all of your days, I know, like, we will go through it, man, this world, we will have tribulation in it, everybody will have tribulation in it, we will all have tribulation in it, because it is not of, we are not of this world, okay, even the unbelievers will have tribulation in this world, okay, you will go through the many different we will all go through these seasons in life of blaming God then another season hoping with God then another season praising the Lord with God then another season on our knees crying with the Lord God and another season we will be making a joyful noise unto the Lord <laughs> you know it's God that shows us in our lives what we need at that time he gives us all of our needs but in each season he gives us the specific needs and he's always showing up and even when he's quiet he is there okay even when you think he's quiet he's not quiet but he is quiet but he's not quiet those times are or times of rest and learning and sitting still with the Lord. You know you have those times too. It's such a blessing to be in the Lord. So um, we will go through these anguish times, these four times, these times of whys. And he won't sometimes answer us the whys. We won't know sometimes until, we won't know everything until we get to heaven. You know, we can only see dimly here. We're going to see in full when we get, when we, when we become glorified, we will see in full. We will know why. We will understand totally. <laughs> That's why I say nobody has it all figured out, but we know that the Lord is close to the brokenhearted. The Lord is close to the joyful. The Lord is close to the, his children for all of, all of our days. And the Lord can and will and does speak and do and show his work in the unbeliever. He really does. He really, really, really does. So, <laughs> anyway, just want to make a short video. Happy weekend. Hope you're resting this weekend. Hope, hopefully, uh, whatever you're going through, God is with you this weekend and all of your days. Love you.